Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I'm Nia G. Today's video is going to be a Gucci Dionysus unboxing. If you're new to my channel, I do lots of unboxings, hauls, I do vlogs, and I also do some beauty content from time to time. So make sure you stay tuned and subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. This is my first high-end luxury bag that I have purchased on my phone so I'm super excited it's like a late birthday gift to myself my birthday was a few weeks ago and I have been eyeing this bag for a while a new everyday bag the bags that I already have I was kind of getting sick of and I wanted to try something new a few Louis Vuitton pochettes that I was looking at um there was a Fendi that I was looking at and I also liked the Gucci Dionysus mini and it's more of a phone holder I mean a phone case type of bag and the YS, there was also a YSL phone case, and those were all the other options. Um, hopefully, I'll insert some pictures of them here. But ultimately, this was the best option, space wise, um, size wise, um, for what I needed for like just something to grab and go that I can fit all of my things into. Buy all of my things, like my mini bags work great but I needed space for my cards my hand sanitizer my lotion um say if I just need to carry something else around you know like this bag is literally the absolute perfect size but that's enough talking let's get into this video here is the bag itself um I did buy this while I was on vacation in Hawaii um in Hawaii they have 10% off all designer items except for the shoes so everything is 10% off of its original price. This bag is originally priced at $1,400 and I ended up getting it for $1,200 with the 10% off, which is absolutely amazing. So this bag is actually a really good price. So if you're ever in Hawaii, check that out. We had an amazing sales rep. His name was Kim. My mom got in contact with him the first time that she went to the Gucci store. And we went to another Gucci store and it was kind of eh. And then we went back to that Gucci store out in Waikiki and he helped us out and we both got bags. And now I'm going to show you guys mine. So of course it came in this green bag, this Gucci green bag. And it's embroidered, super soft. Um, I'm really excited that I was able to fit it in my suitcase. I was kind of worried because I really wanted to keep this bag and it just folds up and the bag comes in here is just literally just boxed in this Gucci box um all the bags come like this all of the Dionysus pieces as you guys can see it is tied up in a cute little bow it's so adorable I don't really want to take it apart but I'm gonna have to for this unboxing let me just admire it I'm gonna take a picture on my phone and do like a little TikTok. all right so here it is I'm undoing it. So I'm undoing the bow. It's been tied up for exactly a week at this point because I didn't want to carry it while I was in Hawaii, especially since I was leaving in just a couple of days. Um, I also have a video of me unboxing it, which I will insert here. Now it comes in the Gucci dust bag. It is canvas. It is super soft. It has the Gucci logo on it. Um, and then I still have the plastic on it. it. Comes like this. So if it was shipped to you or you bought it in store and you didn't ask them to unwrap it for you, they actually ask because a lot of people like to take their bag like home with them, like and wear it right away. So it's wrapped in the styrofoam to protect the canvas. I'm just taking that off. All right. 
So this is the bag. So this is the bag. You guys can see the Dionysus piece right here. So when I went to the store, I initially had my, I always had my mindset on the GG Dionysus. Um, but when I went to the store, our sales rep actually showed me the black leather Dionysus. I will show you guys. It was absolutely beautiful. The Dionysus had, piece had stones on it. It was so beautiful. As you guys can see here, it's just, it is a tiger right here on the head. The signature Gucci tiger and then it's lined out like that. But I ultimately went with this one because... I felt like this was more casual and it is the everyday that I needed. Like I felt like this was a neutral color so it was perfect for everyday which is what I was honestly looking for. The black looked very like still obviously it's black so you can wear it every day but I felt like it was more something that you know when you put on when you're going out and you're being cute. I felt like this like for, the life, for my lifestyle I felt like this was Better and I will get a black eventually. The bag that my mom got is actually black. Um, yeah, so here is the bag. It's like accordion style on the side. This is a leather. Um, so here, the wallet has space for your cards. It has a zipper, so you can put like anything like important like you can put your passport in here if you have something that you want to keep secret on a hush hush i don't know you keep it right there um there's a space right here and there's another space and then there's room for more cards on this side and then the flap and it buttons down it snaps down and then it snaps right down right there and also and you can also take the you can also take the straps off and just wear it as a clutch so you don't have to wear it every single day as a handbag. And once you wear it as a, a clutch, you know, that's like nighttime right there. You know, clutches are more nighttime. The way that I plan to wear it as a purse, you know, with the strap and over the shoulder strap is a little bit, is more what I wanted it for. But you know, it has duality to it. And... Another reason that I went with the GG is because, you know, it was my first Gucci bag. I don't have, like, Gucci anything. Um, I have other items, but I, I have, like, you know, Louis Vuitton, but I don't have anything Gucci. So this is it. This is actually referred to as a chain wallet. Um, it is the Dionysus GG Supreme chain wallet on the website. But it is honestly bigger than a wallet. It can fit my phone with space i have the iphone 12 pro max it literally fits perfectly perfect fit so i won't be carrying my phone in my hand um a lot of women's jeans do not even have pockets so that's something that's kind of like so that's something that's kind of aggravating especially if you're wearing a dress i can just throw my phone i can just throw my phone in my bag no problem go about my day but yes, this is the bag. Also, when I was in the store, um, he showed me how to cross it, which is this is how I think that I will be wearing it more. So I do it in like a little figure eight and then I shorten the straps. So I shorten the straps and then it's a cute little shoulder bag now. It's so cute. It's small, but it's not too small. My phone fits. I can put plenty of other things in here. I'm going to put some of my things in here for you guys so you guys can have a better idea of what fits in this bag. Also, if you guys would like to see me do a styling video, I would love to do that. But let me know if you guys are interested down below in the comments. Or if you guys would like to see the rest of my handbag collection. So this is the back. is canvas. It feels so the canvas feels great. The design, everything is great. Obviously, this was a brand new bag that no one else has touched at all until I got it. So everything is in mint condition and I'm so excited. I'm so happy that I got this, especially for myself. But give me one second and I'm going to fill it up and I'll be right back. 
So I pretty much took everything that was in my LV mini pochette and I just put it in here. Um, so again, here is the bag. Here are the straps. Um, I did actually ask um, if I would be able to replace this if something happened to it. it. He pretty much told me that there is absolutely no way that I could damage it. So yeah, and also the Gucci store does do repairs if necessary and you don't even have to go to your Gucci store. But he told me that this is pretty much indestructible so I'll be good on that front. Um, yeah, so... You open it here, so it's all open accordion style. Here the fire truck, um, yeah, so pull it down this way. I put a dollar in it. This is where you put cash if you had cash in here. So I just put like one dollar and I'll be keeping that dollar in there forever. Um, and this part is the back part of the bag again you can see another little gucci logo i'll be giving you guys a better angle of course but yeah so i have this mini hand sanitizer and i have my carmax and my favorite nyx butter gloss so those three things fit in here um in here i noticed that there were the like you know care instructions the card all that stuff in this part so i just left that in there honestly and i really don't care that much stuff in my bag anyway now in the zipper compartment as you guys can see i just have feminine product in here so i can zip that away if i wanted to i don't know i feel like that's what most people use it for and i put my passports in the passport cover um and i just put that in here because some countries when you travel they require you to bring your um your passport around with you so you get tax off and blah 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 identification purposes so yeah so that's all that can fit well it can fit more one of the card holders i just put one of my business cards in there um because i didn't want to put my id and my debit card in there so that you guys could see it but yeah so this is it and it still closes it still closes pretty flat you can see like there's a few you know ruffles but it still looks decent doesn't look bulky and everything that i need like on a daily basis can fit which is perfect um there's a space for cash my cards which is the most important part um i can't fit a wallet or anything in my gucci i mean in my um, mini pochette so i just carry things around loose extremely problematic um some of my other bags they have like a little space where i can put a card or two in there but it's still not all that i honestly need to invest in a wallet but now that i have this bag and it comes with card holders and it has plenty of space i don't even need to do that this bag is perfect for every single day i can see me carrying this every chance i get especially since it's new it's my first gucci bag um honestly i'm excited for the gg print i really do like a subtle certain logos they're not all that like the fendi option that i was looking towards i kind of i really like the bag and the structure of the bag and honestly i may get it at some other point but i felt like the f's were so big and it wasn't really subtle like from a distance this just looks like an argyle pattern but when it's up close you can see the ggs very clearly and obviously if you know gucci you know that it's you know the gg so that's something that i really like our sales rep um actually said that um for someone that's like you know my age and range you know the gg pattern is still like really fun and youthful like my mom she got a solid black bag um it had some pattern in the it had some pattern in the leather and it had a gg her bag is very subtle very like this is here you go this is the gucci bag and this is it you know but this is and that fits her lifestyle you know it could fit her every she is someone that gravitates more to bigger bags i'm more of a small mini bag type of gal so i got me this bag it's not completely mini but it is small it is a good wallet but still doubles as can double as a clutch and double as an everyday bag and if you did have an even bigger bag you could fit this in there without the straps you can shorten the bag just by crossing it one time but i'm doing the double cross which i will show you guys again how i did it Oops. 
So now, again, I have this short little bag. I'm super excited. I can't wait to wear it. I can't wait to take pictures in it. And check out my TikTok. I did a cute little mini vlog of me in the store. And I'm also going to be posting an unboxing on there. My TikTok is Nia2G. Also, follow my Instagram at m1a.g4. More updates in my everyday life. My Instagram is private, but I do accept requests. Um, if someone's familiar or if they just tell me that they're from YouTube. But yes, that's all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching me unbox my first ever Gucci purse. I'm super excited. Thank you guys so much for supporting. Make sure you guys check out my other hauls and unboxings on my channel. And I'll see you guys. So this, you can see close up the GG print and the Dionysus piece right here. There's literally their signature. Some of the most infamous Gucci pieces are Dionysus pieces. You can see close up. The tiger. It's kind of like an envelope type of clutch. And here are the straps. I have them double lined right now. There's, like you can see, this is like perfect. Very subtle. So metallic. And it's not too harsh. So it doesn't look like shiny, plastic, gross, like, and it feels very sturdy, extremely sturdy. It's definitely, obviously, it's great quality because it is Gucci. So the snap right here says Gucci. It's so easy to pull out. Do it again. The nude leathering on the inside. Um, the bag is on the nude leather on the inside that is zipped here okay so there's one section let's open it the bag has so this has one side right here for your card holders and some cash and then the zipper right here you can unzip it unzipped extremely spacious it, that's just like some paper they have in there and then in here is another section so it has three total sections and then the zipper compartment you can put coins change whatever anything personal you want in there more room there's more room for cards in here you can see that they do have cards There's more room for cards in here. You can see there's another GG. They have some face cards in there. And then they have this another space for some cash. So this is the bag. And this. Oh, and here you can see that this part comes off. The straps come off right there. So it's easy to remove. It's literally just, it's literally just a little snap like this. And then on the back, GG canvas. Look at those G's. Look at those G's. And then straps again. And this is it from the side. The accordion style. And this is another look. This is another look at the back. Very clean, very sleek. Exactly what I was looking for. Um, Understood the assignment basically.